pretty simple. That's the whole song. <laughs> yeah. So Mac, you got Todd here. If you could ask Todd anything, it's a little on the spot. He does this with everybody, oh, so. <laughs> I actually, I do have a question. So I'm curious about this, just because a lot of my friends ask me this, and I feel like I don't really have an answer for them, but what would you say is like your songwriting process? Like, do you have a certain formula that you use when you like write your songs? Do you usually start with the words? Do you usually get a melody first? Like, I'm usually, or is it just kind of spread? you know, I go for the changes first. Well, actually, very first thing you usually go for is, you know, what is a, a rhythmic feel of some kind, mm -hmm. usually? You know, do I want to make a fast song or a slow song? Do I want it funky? You know, do I want it get some sort of idea of what the, what the basic tempo and the, and the rhythmic feel is? Then I start coming up with, usually with changes. If I'm recording, which I usually am, I usually don't write unless I'm making a record. I may get ideas and jot them down, but I'll usually, you know, I will capture them in the same way that I record. I use a uh, software called Reason. And uh, if I have an idea, I'll usually, usually use that to capture it and then later develop it, you know, get the sounds that I want, the other sorts of embellishments. And I write in an odd way because since I'm ultimately making a recording, I'll finish all of the musical part, all of the instruments and the backing, or most all of it. There may be a few things, a few embellishments, but then that's when I come up with the lyrics and the melodies after I've got sort of the instrumental. So I can completely divorce myself from the performance of the instrumental thing and just immerse myself in the musical part of it and that makes it easier for me to come up with the melodies and lyrics oh, yeah although i usually have some idea what the song is about right. I, but i may not have all the lyrics i may just have a title sometimes right. i have a title or maybe a hook line but because my process is so oriented towards the record making aspect of it um, I often will um, defer these uh, final decision about melodies and lyrics till nearly the last minute. Like sometimes I'll write half of the record in the two weeks before I have to deliver it. <laughs> you know, <laughs> uh, the pressure helps that's me. Incredible. Yeah, that's cool. The pressure helps in a way. You know, knowing that you've got a deadline somehow subconsciously makes you be a little bit more creative. At least in my case, it does. If I have all the time in the world, I would take all the time in the world, you know? <laughs> That's fair, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, it's a little different than the way most people do it. Most people, may, you know, sometimes they will pick out the song as they go along. They'll try and find a verse. Right. Lyrics, melody changes, all of that stuff. And then once they got that section, they try and work out the next section. Words, melody, changes, the whole thing. Yeah. But I kind of defer a lot of that until afterwards and when you're working with the uh, you know sound in that modern way when you've got like a digital audio workstation I find myself often just recording um, like little stretches of music but not knowing at first where they go into the larger picture you know yeah. I might think it's a verse but then realize later it's better as a chorus you know so then you just move everything around you know and uh, and you know I like to keep that kind of flexibility in the whole process right I guess I was just curious because like I know for me it like it very much depends on the song yeah. so like some of them I will have all the music first and then I'll try and put words to the music right depending on the feel of music and then other times I'll get like a verse in my mind and yeah that's all that's there I don't know. well as a songwriter i'll take it from wherever it comes oh, you know, right, like, yeah. it's not like i'm setting these rules it's just kind of the way it, yeah. it kind of works for me right, but yeah, no, if know. if i happen if something pops into my head like a lyric or a verse or something like that i'm i'm gonna <laughs> keep it you know yeah. if i think it works you know Absolutely. and at some point that's kind of like how that's a natural part of the process i'll be playing this the music that I made in my head and then things will start to form, you know, lyrics will form and the kind of greater meaning of the song will become clearer to me. Um, 
But it isn't as if I don't every once in a while get a lyrical idea and, and write that out and have to figure out how to fit that to music later. Sometimes, you know, when you're writing a song and you get the initial idea and it starts to come out really fast, and then suddenly it's like a trail that goes cold. You know, you've got two verses and a chorus, but you suddenly can't you know, draw a blank. You can't figure out where to go with it. You know, and so you try and pass it off as finished, you know, with only two verses when the story really needs kind of like to be wrapped up a little bit in that third verse. But, uh, yeah. yeah. Awesome. Okay.